In this tutorial in CyberLink Power Director, we're going to give you a quick overview of what you get in the newly released Fitness Pack. If you're a 365 subscriber, you can download the 54 megabyte pack for free. It contains 20 PIP objects, 12 titles, and 6 particles. If you're not a 365 member, you can buy it for $49.95 US. Is it worth the download? Is it worth the purchase price? Well, you can decide. We're going to help you do that by giving you an overview of all the features that you get if you either download or purchase the Fitness Pack from CyberLink. The first thing we want to show you is you have 20 PIP objects. The first one is simply a pair of racing shoes. Second is barbells up and down. The third one you get is feet on and off of a scale. Again, you can resize and reposition all of these. Number four is an energy drink, apparently, of some kind. Number five is boxing gloves. The sixth one you get is a clock, a stopwatch, which moves both forward and backward. Number seven are some weights that bounce up and down off of some kind of holding device. Number eight is a hand exerciser. The ninth one is a map of some kind pointing from a beginning to an end. Number 10 is an inflated ball, and not very specific what kind it is, which inflates and deflates. Number 11 is a couple of examples of food that might be nutritious. Number 12 is a stationary bicycle. The 13th one you get is a trophy cup, moving up and down. Number 14 is a weight being held up and then dropped. Number 15, a jump rope. Number 16 is a bag that contains exercise equipment, personal gear. The number 17 is a wheel, obviously a hand wheel. Number 18 is a punching bag anchored to the floor. Number 19 is a movable bicycle. Number 20 is a monitor device, some kind of wrist device for health. And those are what you get. Now we have 12 titles. We have an add title here that could work in any situation. So can the second. It's not necessary to use that in an athletic situation. The third one's different. You would expect that with barbells. The fourth title could be used in or outside of athletics. It's a footprint with some stuff there. Number five is also a bit generic, a circle moving around with a spinning title. Number six could be used for geography as well as athletics. Number seven looks like that's basically for some kind of boxing event. Number eight, you could use that for any kind of timing event, the clock. Number nine, with the scales, that's probably specific either to fitness. Number 10 is a, another example of a cup. Number 11 is a bag anchored to the side. And number 12 is another example of a monitor watch. Then you have also six particles. First one is shoes across the bottom with other things in the opposite direction. The second particle you get is uh, boxing gloves and then some kind of confetti, uh, apparently a celebration kind of situation here. Number three that you get would be an example of both uh, nutrition, liquid, and solid for someone who is athletic inclined. Number four is another map, only when you get to the end of the map, there's some other waypoints that go from left to right across the bottom of the screen. Number five, uh, it's hard for me to explain. It looks like a mat rolled out and back with some leaves. I don't get this one at all, <laughs> to be honest with you. Number six in the last one is uh, beach balls on water. Uh, they, they come in from the left and roll to the right. So those are all the components you get in the fitness pack. Is it something worth your download if you get it for free? Maybe, maybe not. I would probably maybe look at the titles as the most valuable part of it. 
Is it worth $50? I probably wouldn't rush to spend that much for it. But it gives you an overview of what's there. So if you want to get it either way, you can from CyberLink PowerDirector.